This video will show how to use the free online graphing calculator linked below to evaluate factorials, permutations, and combinations. The permutation of eight items selected five at a time, or eight permute five, as well as the combination of eight items chosen five at a time, or eight choose five. Notice how there is more than one way to express a permutation and a combination. Either way, we need to identify the value of n and r for the permutation and the combination to know how to evaluate on the calculator. Notice in both cases, n is equal to eight and r is equal to five. And we will use this notation here on the online graphing calculator link below. So let's go ahead and go to the calculator. This calculator does have a lot of features. In this video, we are only focusing on factorials, permutations, and combinations. And therefore, we go down to the very bottom cell here where it says type an expression, click inside the cell. For eight factorial, we enter eight and then an exclamation mark, which is shift one, and then enter. Eight factorial is equal to 40,320. And now let's evaluate eight permute five. To do this, we go back down to the bottom cell, click inside the cell, enter lowercase n, capital P, lowercase r, and then in parentheses, eight comma five. This is a notation for eight permute five. We press enter. Eight permute five is equal to 6,720. And now let's evaluate eight choose five. Go back down to the bottom cell, lowercase n, capital C, lowercase r, and in parentheses, eight comma five. Enter. Eight choose five is equal to 56. Let's go ahead and record these values. Eight factorial is equal to 40,320. Eight permute five is equal to 6,720. Eight choose five is equal to 56. Now you might be wondering how I knew what notation to use for the permutation and combination. Let me show you where you can find this notation. If we go back to the calculator, click help in the upper right hand corner. This opens up the help menu, which goes over all of the features for this graphing calculator. If we click on function reference and scroll down, Under statistical functions, we can see the notation for factorial, permutation, and combination, as well as several other functions. I hope you found this helpful.